What's up guys, it's King Daddy DMac, and welcome back to another episode of Hermitcraft. How's everybody doing? Oh man, oh man, it's been so crazy. I'm so sorry for the lack of videos lately, guys. As you know, I've been at PAX East, and I didn't have much pre-recorded um, to go up beyond the time I was there. So a little busy working. Um, I've been planning out the D McDonald's, of course, of course, that we started last episode. I've been running out of bricks, so I'm just kind of getting more clay together and everything like that, and I'm going to smelt it all up, but everything's going well here. I talked to Corrales. Tomorrow, I'm going to record the derp episode with him, so it will be, watch it not be, <laughs> It will be our next episode, I promise. I just, I, I didn't want to hold back plain vanilla any longer for that. So, I don't know. Should be good, should be good. We got Easter coming up this weekend, which is super cool. I don't know if everybody celebrates Easter, but, I mean, who doesn't love bunnies? They are so cute. Anywho, um, I'm going to smelt all this stuff up, and then why don't we head over to the D McDonald's. Talk maybe a little bit about what went on at PAX. It was it was such an amazing time. That's Penny Arcade Expo. And it was in Boston. So that's where I was for the weekend. And um, yeah, why don't we take it from there? So I'll see you guys back. All right, guys. So the sun's almost coming up. I'm over at the Little Desert. Our base is right over that way. All of our clay finish got tons of bricks. So it should be enough to finish up the D McDonald's. I'm coming over here to grab a bunch of beacons because I think it will make things a bit easier using beacons while we work around there. Get that jump boost. I know there's one over there, but all it has is haste. So this should give us a whole bunch of more effects. So that should be pretty cool and make things a little less dangerous. Jeez. I don't have my bow and arrow. Come over here, zombies. Come on, zombies. Oh my goodness. This is a mess over here. Thank goodness there's no skeletons. All right, let's try and let's try and get through. Oh, go away, go away, go away, go away, go, 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 go. Oh my, jeez, that was dangerous. All right, so let's head back. But um, yeah, it packs east this weekend. I was a little surprised. Um, there wasn't a whole heck of a lot of YouTubers there. There was a couple of guys from Minecraft, um, which I've met before. Uh, good pause. I think Jasono, um, who else was there? Oh, Badge was there, and a whole, a, a good amount of the Minecrackers, but as far as other YouTubers, Spoon was there, he was really the only other Hermit, Aurelian, I don't think, is technically part of Hermitcraft anymore, and she's more of a streamer, anyway, but really good friend, really, really cool girl, definitely check all these people out. Um, but yeah, there was a whole heck of a lot of streamers, and it was really, really neat getting to meet a lot of these people. Um, let's see, let me turn this down. Oh, and Direwolf was there. That was cool, and I got to hang out with a lot of the Forgecraft people, which is very cool. And, um, yeah, there was, there was just a heck of a lot of streamers there, and it really kind of got me thinking. A lot of them said... I can't believe, DMAC, that you don't stream. And it's I think it's something that I might try. I was a little disappointed because there is a Twitch party that I couldn't go to because I don't... I have a Twitch account, but I've only streamed, like... I don't know, barely, enough to say it's almost like I've never streamed. But I really think it's something that I might want to try. I, th I don't think it would be too difficult. I don't know that I'd be the best. But it looks like it would be a lot of fun. And I think that you guys... Might enjoy it as well. Hey, Hypno. <laughs> Let me see what he wants. All right, guys. So we're at spawn. Any new mail? Any new mail? Nope, nothing new. Nothing new. All right. So I hung out with Hypno for about an hour or two. Just seeing what was up. Nothing, nothing too much. Apparently there's some type of Easter thing going on that I got to avoid around here. But we should, I, I think I'm going to actually have another thing up on Easter Sunday. Oh, and we forgot to do this maze. Oh, okay, so everyone's doing the time. I remember at the beginning of the last episode, we started to talk about it, that we we're going to do it, and then we never did it. So how do I start this? Um, 
All right, times. Do I do I click that and then I go? I'm assuming I I fell down here. Oh no! Is this this better be the right way? I know Schism was having trouble with it as well. Oh, this is so confusing. All right, maybe we should go back up to the top. Because I don't think we should have any viewable redstone. Oh, goodness. <laughs> I'm going to... Oh, okay, that's, that's got to not be the right entrance. So where would be, okay, maybe this is the right entrance, or is this the exit? Alright, and I don't even have a timer going. Oh, this looks like it's the exit. Oh, goodness, Mumbo. Where? Is there not a sign that says where this thing starts? Is that it? Is that the actual start? I feel like it should be, like, right here. All right, is there something we can... I'm confused. I'm, I'm going to wait. I'll watch another video as far as where you go. But anyway, got other shops opening up in the area. Salad and KFC. Man, you throw up one sign and then the whole world comes over here. <laughs> Which is good, though. Brings more business. So anyway, I started adding in a road. Which is kind of nice. And I got to continue it. I just got back from Joe Hill's old sheep farm. Which I think we can just start continuing this on. Adding it in. Right like this. I went over to uh, the XBD server. Which is now. That's Exumavoid's um, server. And it's public. For anyone that wants to go and hang out. And meet people there that are Hermitcraft fans. And... And whatnot. It's not a Hermitcraft server. It's Exumavoids. But um, it's pretty neat. Some of us go there sometimes. And I guess it's it's changed now. And he's doing it with Doc M from uh, Minecraft. And they've got all sorts of survival games and stuff. So whatever. Get a little shout out for your server. But it was cool time. And they've got a creative world there. And sometimes, it's been a little while since I've done this. But sometimes I'll go over there. Because they've got some pretty good builders. And people help me out. So I promise the guys that help me out with the D McDonald's that I uh, give them a little shout out. So I'll show a picture of all the people's names on the signs that help to work on that. But I don't want to go there yet because I don't want to reveal everything that's new. So let's get all this dirt filled in. I really shouldn't have cheated this. Do, doing this whole level like that right above but it's a pain bringing all my resources back to spawn because it takes it takes a good little while to get back and forth all right so anyway let's get this all done um as far as pax heat stuff other fun stuff i was talking about streaming and i think it's something that i'm going to try i finally just got a webcam which that was one of the things that held me back for a while from doing it just because I wanted to be able to have a face cam for you guys and I still haven't decided if I'm going to do a face cam in, in actual videos or not I don't know if that's like distracting I might try it but I don't I don't not even sure how I'd record two different things at the same time what whether I can just use DX Tori for that or, or even what you do so I'll have to find out you guys will have to let me know in the comments how in the heck you do that but anyway, I have underneath here, these are carpets, and I've got hidden torches. Just for some lighting. Which is pretty cool. And this is going to bend around... Oh, this is a little off. I'm going to have to move these. But this is meant to be centered, so this will be like the drive through Coming across the front, and then turns around over to here. Um, still, I still haven't gone mining for all the quartz, which we're going to replace all this iron with quartz and I think it will look much better once we do that these are meant to be I think they're called awnings or so forth so we'll, we'll get to that and more of the interior and I've been messing around with since the last video just just other stuff and things does he have a sign yet up here I hope he doesn't because I need more chicken how horrible is that that I'm eating over a can uh, corrales fried chicken still no sign <laughs> Still nothing. 
get my chicken. So I'm going to work on this for a little bit more and see if we can get the outside finish today. I'd like it to say something across the top. I'm thinking for, for names for this, D McDonald's, it's, that's, that's the name. But I'm thinking maybe we could just call the place like Double D's or something like that, and that might be a little bit easier. We'll see if we can fit the whole D McDonald's in a little pixel art of text. And then as far as the interior, I got a really, really cool designs from everybody on the Respawn Network, it's now called. So I think it should come out pretty good. So anyway, I'm going to clip out for a bit while I'm working on this. And we can come back and see the progress. All right, that is looking pretty snazzy. I'm liking it. And maybe when we have the derp, he can help us with doing a car because he's so good at doing all dem cars. I want to have like a little overhang over here. Let's see. Let me go get my bricks. Mm. There we go. And let's get all these weird wool colors out of the way. So we want to have, I'm going to bring this up one higher. Going all the way across. In fact, let's just jump up there. Get out of here, Torchy Torch. It's been so treacherous working here at night. So many close calls, but I've got, let's see what I can see all of my effects right here. With strength too, I'm pretty much able to kill, I think every mob one shot him with just like a pickaxe just about. So that's pretty good. All right, so we've got that fixed. I'm gonna throw some stairs. I think upside down stairs, maybe like that. That looks cool, that looks cool. And then let's do maybe some stay oh wrong way. Can I get can I get some upside down stairs here? Why do I suck at doing that? <laughs> I'll do I'll fix that later. Let's just do this across like this. We'll have it line up and go right over here. I think that should be cool. So I'll have like a little overhang when it comes to the windows when the car drives through. Let's see, should I have this go all the way to the end? I'm not sure yet. So let's extend this out. Maybe to like right here, except it was one higher. And then this will come down. Man, it would be cool if they had like brick fence posts or something. Definitely would dig those. All right, that looks cool. That gives it a little more flavor first drive through window where they pay and then where they pick up their food and then they can drive off a cliff <laughs> into a river but we don't care because they've already made a purchase they've already bought from d mcdonald's all right so what are we going to do next oh yeah i said i was going to throw in the stairs here let's see if i can get the upside down ones there we go there we go that's what we're looking for so i'm going to do that and then I think maybe we could start working on some of the texture art in the front. Because I want the front to look good before we start worrying about the inside. And as you can see with the inside, I've already started messing around with the texture here. Um, the guys on the Respawn Network were saying that I should maybe try like furnaces for over there. Let me just see what that would look like. Do we have... And this whole mountain's gone, by the way, if I didn't already mention that. For Exumavoid's new soup shop, eh? Do I have a crafting table? All right, here we go. So let's see what this would look like with furnaces in here. And it just gives another interesting type of block. They could possibly all... I actually think it looks kind of nice with the grass. Oh, dang it. See, I gotta stop cheaping out on stuff. That looks pretty good. Because I think McDonald's floors are usually tiled. I think it looks pretty good. I might go with like a brown instead. I'm not sure yet. But we have all that cobble to work with. So anyway, let me work some more on that. And then I'm thinking we can do the pixel art right on top there. 
and maybe add a few more decorations, but I think for the most part the outside's done. And then let's finish this drive through, because I think that's really going to be what ties it together. All right, guys, so progress update. It's a day later. I think this is about all that I'm going to do for today. We're going to get some more quartz, and I got to figure out, how do you like the pixel art? It says Donald so far. And then we'll put DMAC on top, maybe. I use two different color woods just because it's it's a cheap material. But I want to know what you guys think of that so far. And of course, we could do it in like quartz and something else. We got to have something that you can use half slabs and stairs in order to get the full texture. So quartz definitely could work. Possibly brick? Brick, maybe? I don't know. I need two of them to give contrast so you can actually make out the pixel art letters but also look good. I'm not huge on that with the wood, but I think it'll be good enough for now. Finish the drive-thru, or at least the structure of the drive-thru, which is I think is cool. So I'm digging it, and I gotta get a whole bunch more clay, a whole bunch more quartz, and take a look at this. I actually I had just enough quartz to do like this section here, and all I got left is like stairs. So I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. I think we're going to end off the working on the D McDonald's today until I get more resources. I did a little bit of the inside. This was suggested by one of the guys on the Respawn Network doing it like this. I think that looks pretty sweet. And then we can put like our menu items up here, something like that. Give us plenty of room in the back. I don't know if I need three, but this way we can put maybe a counter in on the back put we still haven't decided what we're gonna sell here maybe a couple brewing stands for like milkshake machines soda machines and stuff like that and then we can always do it downstairs if we need more room so i think that's pretty cool and i think i am going to switch up the floor to a darker color other than the yellow but anywho i heard one of the culprits, either schism or pungence, I'm not sure which, but one of them wants to turn themselves in for the arrest. Remember we did the arrest warrants last time? Not last time, but a couple times ago. I heard one of them, and they must be feeling guilty. So, we shall see. And I guess we're going to make the arrest. We're going to be... Nobody's, nobody's stepped forward for the sheriff position. So, whether it's just as a PI or as, as the Hermitcraft sheriff, I will step forward and I will make... Uh, a citizen's arrest. So anyway, let's go check that out. All right, guys. Say goodbye to New Hermiton for a while. We're on our way over here, heading through the arch, the D-Max Detective Agency, where the PI himself awaits us. Ugh, can't, I can't get my <laughs> stupid steps. Can you hear me? You can hear me coming. I see you. I see you. Where's your... Oh, God. <laughs> Dude, your desk is behind. That's, that's confusing. It's tight quarters, but you know, rent's expensive here. Right, right. Enough. <laughs> you look so funny sitting in this. Enough laughing. Very serious I, business. You have issued a warrant for my arrest and Pungence's arrest. Mm -hmm. I have discussed it at zero length with my my friend, <laughs> but I have decided I have decided to come and turn myself in. You're going to come peacefully. Peacefully, willingly, so that this, this matter can be resolved in the quickest fashion possible. That's good man. Good man. I don't know I what we're going to do about Plungy, though. He said he, he wanted, he made note about resisting and hate F the police. What? And uh, <laughs> anarchy, treason, such things. All right, so what, what do you do when you get arrested? Do you have to, like, turn over your stuff? I don't know. I've never been arrested before. I've never arrested anybody before. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're both new at this, so... Well, I'm going to give you the arrest warrant, so it's official. Okay. Okay. This will go in the evidence chest. Okay. Now, I guess I just got to turn over all my tools, all my weapons. Mm -hmm. No birthday cakes with, like, chisels in them. <laughs> no, of course not. Thank you for the idea. I, I brought a lot of food. Why? Why is this happening? I brought a lot of food mm -hmm. for the trip. Maybe you can squeeze some of that through the uh, into the the cell. Okay, we'll, we'll let's grab some gruel for you to eat while you're there. All right, I would I would love some gruel. 
All right, and I, I think we should get something to lock you in because I don't think there's any doors on the... <laughs> <laughs> what kind of jail cell is this? It's a really evil looking jail cell. Yeah? I'd say, all right, let's go get you some gruel. I guess I'm coming with some you. MS gruel. <laughs> MS? <laughs> all right, got You know, I could just wander off right now. Well, you're coming quietly. Don't wander in there, man. You'll get lost forever. I can't even yeah. find the start of that thing. I already beat that thing. Did you? How long did it take you? <laughs> no. I wandered into the, the service elevator shaft by accident. Oh, wait. You got to put your hands behind your back. No, oh, you're right. All right. Uh, I don't know how to do that. <laughs> Are we going this way? Mm-hmm. Okay. You have very fashionable jeans. I have to say, I've never really looked at them. Yeah, well, they're not going to last long when I get in the slammer. Uh-oh, uh-oh, run. Yeah. <laughs> Just protect me. <laughs> People are trying to kill me on my way. <laughs> the locals are very upset about the whole ABBA thing. Out of here. I know they are. All right. So we're going to be walk around back, I think. Oh, I lost him. <laughs> <laughs> Escape. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm, com I'm coming peacefully, so everyone, everyone just relax. Do I go this way? I've never been to jail before. Right, we're going to go up around here. Are there going to be guys screaming fresh fish at me? I think you're the only person arrested. Yeah, fresh Ooh. fish, fresh fish. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's got to spit blood on me as I walk in. Do um, you have any preference? Yeah, do I get to pick? Yeah, sure. Why not? I was always the kind of, you know what? See, I got an issue here. I'm always the kind of guy that wants to be like in the back corner, but I'm thinking... I might want some sunlight. <laughs> that might not be a good idea. In I might want some sunlight. I'm going to pick this corner right here. All right. So here's your gruel. Make it last. <laughs> Just get the one. Ooh. Two, three, four, five. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. And... Okay. Huh. That's going to have to work. Don't take it. Is it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess this is an honor system type of jail. <laughs> mm -hmm, pretty much, pretty much. You got your toilet. Okay. You got. I don't know what those things are in the bed. Those are your shackles. This is it a toilet? I think that's a toilet. Yeah, oh, I gotta go to the bathroom, man. <laughs> um, don't watch me go. I can't watch. Oh, I can't oh, go if you're oh, watching. Oh, excuse me, sir. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, so I guess the shackles are here to shackle you to the toilet. Apparent, maybe it's a really uncomfortable toilet. People are like, yeah. no, don't make me. <laughs> the toilet just comes up around you. Pretty much. Uh, so, all right, I'm here. I guess I'll just await. Now, I'm going to need a phone call, but I'll take care of that later. Oh, okay. Maybe you could, you could write a book. I could deliver it for you. Okay. Ooh, that could work. All right. Yeah, I'm going to need a phone call, but I'll take care of that later. And then I guess I'm just going to be waiting in here until... The next thing that happens. All right, so I'll see you in a couple right. months once we get around months? to it. What? What? <laughs> a couple? A couple? What? Or I mean, the next episode. Couple. Okay, that's better. <laughs> that's better. Um, I guess I'll have to make this gruel last really long. Here, do I have any? Yeah, that's all the gruel you get. All right, mm. you, you stay in there. Okay, I have second thoughts about jail, Dmac. I don't want to go to jail. You know, it kind of suits you. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Look you good in so? there. Look very good in there. Really? Okay. Yeah. Well, I guess I'll stay then. I think I think you're gonna need like a, a pinstripe uh, skin though. Yeah. Yeah. You'll you have to drop all, you'll have to drop some clothes off for me. All right. All right. All right. Well, you stay there and uh, pungence. Hopefully, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to find this guy. What a sneaker! He's gonna resist arrest. Mm-hmm. He mentioned killing you specifically. What? Um, something about a bomb. Uh. Nuclear, maybe? I can't remember the oh, exact details. Oh, my goodness. Um, he's going to trip you and make you fall into a vat of whipped cream and then shave your entire body. Ooh. Kinky. Got Kinky. a little weird. <laughs> Got a little weird. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm just going to sit here and go and go to the bathroom for the next two months. All right. Well, I will see you at the court case, I guess. I'm going to put the evidence... In the evidence chest. Yeah, you do that. Warrants. You do that, D-Mac. All right, and you behave down there. Okay. Shenanigans. I'm having a great time. Thank you for jail.
Oh my goodness. So it was Schism. What a good guy. I love Skizzy. So anyway, we're going to have to watch out for Pungy. He is apparently, yeah, he's going to resist arrest. And he's going to try and kill me and do all these things. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm not up for being sheriff. <laughs> Anywho, um, I wanted to try and even do this Easter egg hunt that's going on that Mumbo set up. He should be videos out at some point today, if not already about it. But I think we might, I might hold that off for my actual Easter episode. I should have another upload this Sunday. Hopefully that will be when I have the derp up as well. And um, yeah, I think we're going to end things off here, guys, because it's been, it's been about time. So thank you oh so much for watching. As always, don't forget to leave a comment. Help me out with all the the questions I had about the D McDonald's, what materials should we do for the pixel art sign on the top? Should we even have one? I still am going to have another little post here that has like a, a golden arches or something. And um, yeah, any of the other questions I left in the video, Derp should be next episode for sure. For sure. I'm recording with him today. And um, yeah, guys, hit that thumbs up. Help me out. Get better noticed on YouTube. I love it. It is really, really appreciated but only if you enjoyed the episode. So till next time, guys, thanks for watching, and peace out.